Meanwhile, on to another tragic incident. Police in Egypt say they believe a suicide bomber carried out Sunday's bus bombing that killed four people, including three Koreans. After reviewing CCTV footage of the attack, police concluded the bomber boarded the tourist bus and detonated explosives near the door. An al-Qaeda-affiliated Islamist terrorist group in Egypt known as Ansar Bayit al maktiz has claimed responsibility for the bombing, saying it had previously warned it was planning an attack. In an online statement Monday, the group promised to continue to target the state's leaders and economy by hitting tourism sites and blowing up natural gas pipelines. Meanwhile, 15 survivors of the attack who were expected to return to Korea on this Tuesday are still in Israel as they are struggling to find a flight home.